little romance for someone from American Idol. Yeah, Paul McDonald, the ex-contestant. Uh, hey, he didn't win the uh, the the Idol, but how about this, Nikki Reed? He's got one of the what the Twilight. Twilight. Vampires? I have to fill you in every I time. Know. He's not really up on that stuff. Are you, you know, team Edward or you team? Uh, you Jacob? know what? I actually am team Jacob. I yeah. love. Team Jacob is awesome. Those abs, hello. But sometimes it depends on which arena I'm in. You know, yeah. mm -hmm. if Edward is the majority, I'll go with Edward. He's hot, too. <laughs> <laughs> He's hot. Anyways, here we are with traffic, ladies and gentlemen. There's a building fire in Bridgeview, Harlem at 78th Street. Now, the fire department is on the scene, and they took two people for smoke inhalation. So you want to be aware that there is a lot of activity going on right there. Now, there's a rollover accident um, at Eisenhower at First Avenue. Now, the fire department... Department, police and ambulances are on the scene and they block the left two lanes so please take heed to that as well and there is a water main break right here on California at State Street and it started an hour ago still gushing and we don't know when it's going to end it may take a couple of hours but that's your traffic back to you Steve and Susan you know I always feel bad telling everybody it's not going to be so great on the weekend right. but this time at least your horror it's 50 50 today not so great but tomorrow the sun comes back. So now you use today to plan for tomorrow. You That's it. what I'm doing. I, I know that for sure I want to hit the lakefront. We're early out there. My husband and I, fire, he's a firefighter, so we're ready to go on the lakefront. Ready to go. So we have today to plan. Here you go. So now you can plan your commute right now. In fact, there is a building fire in Bridgeview at Harlem Avenue and 78th. Now the police and the fire department took two individuals because of smoke inhalation. So it's still a little bit of baggage right there in that area, so take heed to that. There's a rollover accident right here at the Eisenhower at First Avenue. The fire department, police, and ambulance are still on the scene, and they blocked the left two lanes. So you do want to be aware of that accident there. And then there's a water main break, California Avenue and Taylor Street. Now, it just started about an hour ago, and it's still gushing. They say it's probably going to take several hours for it to get fixed. So, ladies and gentlemen, on the highways and byways, please take heed. Here you go, your traffic. Back to you, Steve and Susan. You gotta know a fireman, right? To help yeah, us with that. You should, you really. Go. I love my fireman. <laughs> I love the fireman. Take your spot over here. Yay, this so is it right here. Come on over here, so you're real right by smooth. that low piece of tape. Because, probably because you're you a spokesperson. It. Tell us about your job. Um, I tour with the National Auto Show, um, and I hope to soon end touring with the auto show, because hopefully I'll be right here with you all every morning. <laughs> but I do their public speaking and narrating, and I've been doing that for about five years now. And um, I do a lot of stuff on my own. I host and produce an internet show. So I, it was more so like for fun for me. So mm -hmm. I'm looking for something that I can take professionally, which is why I'm really super duper uber excited about this opportunity <laughs> to be with everyone. Yeah. How'd you meet your husband? Oh, we've been together for eight years. Right. And I met him through a mutual friend. Okay. And he used to work for Chicago Public Schools. And then he took the test. They said, answer the call. So he answered the call. <laughs> and he's now Tower Ladder 34 on 79th and South Chicago. Okay. So nice. I'm very, very proud of him. And we're hoping that we can, we're residents here. And we're hoping that we can really represent Chicago, me on the news side, and him actually working out there on those highways yeah. and byways. So no I think it would be a nice fit. Yeah, really, cool. ex really yeah. excited, though.